With New York City Fashion Week in full swing, we're seeing how the worlds of wine and fashion are colliding. No one knows that better than sommeliers, trained professionals who specialize in all aspects of wine service. Joining us today from New York City, Penfold's winemaking ambassador, Dylan Proctor, and from GQ Magazine, executive stylist, Brett Valgren. Good morning, gentlemen. Good morning. Good morning. So why do wine and fashion pair so well together? Well, at GQ, we like to uh, think of guys as being well-rounded. That's really an important thing, always evolving. And it's not just about looking good and wearing the right clothes. It's about uh, living a complete lifestyle. So mm. that includes knowing how to pick out a great bottle of wine, uh, setting the playlist when you have friends come over for a party. Um, it's really that approach that we appreciate the most at GQ, and we like to talk about at the magazine. Mm -hmm. Dylan, what is the role of today's modern sommelier. I've heard you talk about what appealed to you when you first got into it. Um, but in 2015, what's the role? I believe the role has changed a bit today, sommelier. The modern sommelier is all about diversification. No longer donning the Tostavan, no longer donning the stark white shirt with the mm -hmm. stiff collar and, and black suit. It's all about incorporating color and style and haberdashery, maybe even rolling up the sleeves and showing the tattoos, wearing a sweater vest, wearing tailored jeans with a pair of loafers. Today's sommelier is so different. As mm -hmm. much as we pay attention to our wine lists and our guests and our grape varieties and the bottle producers, mm -hmm. we pay the exact mm -hmm. same attention to what we're wearing on the floor. The key is to make it look effortless as well. You never want to look mm -hmm. like you're trying too hard as a guy. So that's one of the things that's important. There is a best dress contest between the two of you, Penfolds and GQ. What do you want our viewers to know about that? Well, the key is it started September 1st and it goes through till the 30th. And it's really a national call for all the guys and women out there to enter and send in their pictures. Um, with Instagram, you want to put in the hashtag best dress song, uh, mm -hmm. also on Twitter. And everybody at GQ and Penfolds were keeping a very close eye on all the entries. We did this last year. We're super excited to be doing it again this year. And the entries have already been coming in. The entries are looking fantastic mm -hmm. as well. There are some incredible looking young women, incredible looking young men. And we are looking forward to bringing the top five finalists to illustrious New York City where the best dress sum will be awarded mm -hmm. by a great panel of judges. <laughs> You're going to get to be in GQ, and nice. uh, yeah, it's a really cool uh, contest. So how can our viewers incorporate that sommelier style into their own lives? And here in the Midwest, we're fairly practical, so maybe give us some stuff we can actually apply. Well, I would say just in a general style question, um, for, for men in particular, it's all about fit. Just make sure your clothes fit properly. A lot of guys wear their clothes a little yeah. bit overly baggy. Uh, you don't need, you know, that hand tailored look. You don't have to spend a lot of money by any means. Um, and even guys who are wearing casual items, like if they like to wear polo shirts all the time, you don't want to look like a soprano and then be in a big uh, polo shirt. You want to have it be a little bit more fitted. And that's really what we like to talk about. But it's, it's really effortless style that's the key and, um, and just always evolving. That's the whole point. And that's mm -hmm. why we're talking about evolving and how you know how to pick out a bottle of wine to also how to put together your style. Mm -hmm. I think this and for me and for Penfolds, it's about yeah. picking a it's about picking a ball of our Penfolds Ben 389 Cabernet Shiraz blend. We affectionately call this wine Baby Grange, a beautiful <laughs> wine with a long finish, mm -hmm. elegant, big tannin bowl. It's a wine that is built to last. <laughs> Thank you, Dylan and Brett. A pleasure to visit with you today. Thanks Thank so much. Thank you very much, Mary. Thank you. Mike?